What's up? It's your boy Tell. I'm alive and I'm back editing with another video. I hope you're all doing well. Right, um, in this video I'll be drawing Octane from the game Apex Legends, a game which I used to have time to play. Yeah, I guess I don't really have time to do much anymore aside from... Okay, anyways, we're making the most of time. Right, um, oh cool, in this video um, and every other video forward I am going to start giving away drawings. Um, the the drawing which I am giving away in this video will be shown at the end of the video and I'll further explain on how to win that. I guess it's winning it, but yeah, anyways. Um, fortunately it's not a picture that has anything got to do with Octane, but it is a drawing which I drew a while back and I'll send it out to the winner for free. Yeah, anyways, so back to this drawing. I like to start the drawing by using a light pencil as usual just to kind of put in the figures and put in the base detail. And the reason I use pencil for this is, well, because it's easy to just... Actually, yeah, yeah I already spoke in an earlier video that I don't mind making mistakes. But I knew that I was going to colour this pencil in and it was a commission for a friend, so I really wanted to kind of get it right. Yeah, um, cool. So anyways, if you haven't played the game Apex Legends, basically it's rather close to a game like Fortnite or PUBG. Um, basically in those games you parachute into a desolated island and um, I just felt like I, I felt like I just used that word long wrong <laughs> wrong okay I'll cut that out anyways um, right so you drop down you find some guns and you try to survive um, an example of the game would be you fly down you enter a building and on the floor you're finding you find a beautiful Mozambique now for those who don't know what a Mozambique is it's only the best shotgun pistol in the world or in, in that game. Then you're like, okay, cool, I got this, I'm sorted. You see some guys punching each other out and you run upstairs, only to find some shotgun ammo and another Mozambique. Right, well, I actually kind of missed playing the game because it was pretty funny, especially when you're playing with friends. And um, actually, yeah, gaming's really cool because if you think about it, you jump into all these different worlds and um, you discover these new way of living lives. Um, that's a bit extreme because, I mean, what if you're just playing a game like I was going to say FIFA. Oh, I just did say FIFA, but I tried to hide behind saying that I just was about to, but then I ended up like, hey. <laughs> Right. Nothing's wrong with that game, or any other sports game for that matter. What I mean is, like, I'm personally more into RPGs like God of War, etc. And um, in those games, you have, like, beautiful scenery, great storylines most of the time. And, um, yeah, you can just really get lost in those worlds. Cool. Well, um... Back to the drawing, uh, at this point we're pretty much using the markers to colour in the base um, the base colours, so I like to lay down the flat tones and then go over with, like, layer on top of it, I like to put on the darker tones until I kind of get more of like a 3D looking image. And um, when you're drawing, don't be afraid to like, don't be afraid to like, well, how would I phrase that? Basically. Your drawing's gonna look ugly from the get like there's gonna be a stage where you're not gonna be happy with the drawing and it'll be right in the beginning, but just don't give up and you just keep building up in layers and eventually you'll hopefully start to like it. But it's not like in ten minutes you're just gonna knock out a Picasso. Uh, yeah, so just keep at it, you know. And uh, keep practicing. Um Yeah, well, actually you know with Apex Legends I wasn't really good at the game. <laughs> Um, but yeah, that's okay, because I guess when I came to start every new game, I'd look for a single moment where I could do something that would make me of use to the team. And I guess that's kind of true in many things in life. It's about creating small, achievable goals, and even if it's something that seems silly, like, for example, in the game, I used to think I'm at least going to shoot someone and do some damage before I die, because there'd be some games where I'd end the game having done no damage whatsoever. Honestly, there are some really good people out there that just snipe you straight away, you don't even know where the bullet came from. Alright, anyways, the more you practice, the better you get at it, and provided you do it smart, because, um, well there's a phrase that I heard a long time ago saying, practice doesn't make perfect, only perfect practice makes perfect. Hmm. Yep, and it makes sense to me because it's like, there's a possibility of picking up bad habits before you, you do as practice, and, um, without knowing exactly what it is you're trying to achieve. Now, it doesn't really mean you should sweat over how much or how to practice perfectly. 
at least I think so. Um, I think that most things you've simply got to start and then just be smart about it. Like at any point you've got to be willing to give up what you think you know is perfect in order to relearn something. Huh, that makes sense in my head but I'm not sure if I correctly conveyed that. Right, anyways, let's uh, talk about the giveaway. So in every video I'll be giving away a drawing of mine and I'll send it out. Um, to have a shot at winning is pretty simple and I'm open to better suggestions. Basically somewhere in the video I'll pose a question and all you've got to simply do is subscribe and answer the question, post it in the comments. You know actually it feels a bit like I'm forcing subscribers to so scratch that part. You just subscribe if you want to, but you don't have to do that in order to win. Anyways, from there I'll read all the answers and I'll give each comment a number and I'll put it through a random number generator and we'll have a winner. And then from there I'll send you a message, I'll wait your reply and I'll have the drawing sent out to you wherever you are. So um, there'll be like a week in between the drawings which I'm giving away or maybe a few days but yeah so I'll announce the winner at the end of each week and yeah hopefully that that works out. Yeah, yeah. when I used to start drawing I'd always give away my drawings anyways because um, I don't know I, I didn't really well, I don't like my drawings to be honest, and I it kind of baffled me when other people would say that they liked them, so I'd rather give it to people that, you know, enjoy or appreciate it. And it's just kind of my way of saying thanks, yeah. Anyways, um, cool, while well, I didn't want to put off making this video, and um, yeah, thanks for watching and taking the time to comment. Um, if you did like what you saw then please do consider subscribing and liking, it does help me out and any comments which, you know, give some feedback as to how I can improve, I'd much appreciate it. Cheers, hope you have a great night, see you next time guys, bye. Okay, yeah I almost forgot actually, uh, the question to answer to be in the draw to win the drawing for this week is what's the most valuable or just a lesson that you've learned from a game cool and op which game <laughs> I guess and if you haven't if you don't play games then um, just what's a lesson that you've learned from life that you'd like to share I'd really be interested to hear your answers and I can't wait cool have a good night guys or day depending on where you are cool bye for real this time <laughs>